Blacklist Internasional. Tak, as mentioned, has been here for... Hierarchy Hoshi. An M series champion will become <laughs> two friends in their roster. They will take on the challenge to bring glory to the host country, Indonesia. Coming from their MPLI 2022 victory, Onik Esports. Onik Esports is not short on achievements nor. RSG Singapore. Group C will be consistent performance over the year. RSG Singapore is set to once again compete in the international stage. Respect all, fear none. RSG Singapore. The two time MPL Singapore champions definitely own. Tim Tim Hak from Malaysia. Started from qualifying for season 10 and qualifying for Worlds. Their team is one to consider as a threat. Coming as the MPL Malaysia season 10 champions, we have Team Hak. Oh. Hierarchy oh. Akira. Ah. New king is born on the other side of the world to conquer the world stage of mobile legends after dominating their region. We have RRQ Akira. First off, I'd like to say congratulations, Mi Irmaus from Brazil. Occupy Thrones, Mena. Ah. Wanting to establish a good foundation for mobile legends in Mina. They seek to perform well in the world stage. Occupy Thrones. Also known as Thrones Esports. Toda Malaysia. <laughs> Langar Todak. Todak, as mentioned, has been here for every single M. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Incendio Supremacy. Withdrew from last year's Turkish Championship to qualify for M3. They are now taking on the world stage this year as Turkey's representative. We have Incendio Supremacy. Finishing their qualifying. Oh. Falcon Esports. Oh. The dark horse of the world stage has arrived to prove Myanmar's name should still be in everyone's radar. We have Falcon Esports. I have to be honest, it's going to be difficult for the Burmese to aim high and fly high. Going into Group A, they are grouped in with a relative. Malpinas Gaming Latam. Another opportunity for Harley and his new teammates to show the world the capability of Peruvian MLBB. This is Malvinas Gaming. Malvinas Gaming making a comeback from M. Hierarchy Hoshi. 
Ready? Uncrowned kings on their quest to reclaim their rightful throne. Fans will surely welcome their hometown heroes and cheer them on to win their first international title. RRQ Hoshi. Anywhere in the world that you see RRQ Hoshi compete, it seems... Dofeli, North America. Moba Zayn is back to the world stage to show that NA can become MLBB champions. Joining forces with M1 Legends of Team Gosu, the Valley. Story upon story upon story to say that the Valley. Oh, no. <clears throat> S11 Argentina. The first ever MLBB Latam Super League. They will spearhead in making Latam a mark in world history. S11 Gaming, Argentina. Between these two names that were at the top of... Echo oh. Philippines. Oh. <laughs> Two's finals MVP, Carl Tizi, is back again. Hungry for another world title with his new super team. Loud and proud, Echo. I can already hear Ang Limang Echo fans. Now we're about to find out. MBA it's Fort Mekong. After beating Mekong's favorites, IDNS, they will now prove themselves to be worthy of contending for the world title. MDH Esports. It's a long road, or river, should I say, <laughs> for MDH Esports to make it here, but the Vietnam... Burn Express, Cambodia. Having claimed their first ever win in MPL Cambodia and their first world stage, Coach Zico and his team will prove themselves to parallel with most teams. Burn X Flash. The final team to be seeded into Group A and finishing up our group draw, Burn X Flash going into this. Mm, I don't know. It's it's uh it's something else. Group A, but with. Hessa, Sikat, and uh, 